Hi Grizzlies, Mrs. Baker, one of your school counselors with your tip for this week. And one of the coping strategies that comes to mind that I personally use and I've worked with a lot of students to use is the idea of what do you have control over and what do you not have control over. So sometimes when you're dealing with situations that can be frustrating or that are causing some stress, it's a good reminder to just think about, okay, what do I have control over versus what do I don't have control over? For example, I don't have control over other people's values or behaviors, um, but I do have control over how I react to them or how much time I spend on social media or my own values and beliefs. So just think about that next time you're kind of grappling with a topic or struggling with something. Um, for those of you who like to write things down, just a piece of paper with a line down the middle, what do I have control over and what do I not have control over can sometimes help kind of clarify and maybe reduce some of the stress. And when in doubt, remember your school counselor is always here for you, Grizzlies.